what is up beautiful babe sweet angel welcome in welcome what can i say y'all i'm looking hella crazy i already know you don't have to say nothing girl i have one eyelash on one partially on it's a mess okay last night <laughs> oh, it was kind of rough i don't know it was kind of rough okay so we're gonna show you how i take off my lashes and i think everybody probably does the same mechanism because a lot of these things are pretty much dictated by the lash industry because i have several little things here that i'm going to show you hopefully they're all still on the market uh, i know one or two of them are but Anywho, when it comes to removing these lashes or lash extensions, very simple process. All it takes, hey, get you some false scara remover by Kiss. You can get this, and I just shook it up because it was not originally that cloudy, okay? Or I use the Anu Hydrofusion Micellar Water, which is this right here. Mm-hmm okay or girl beauty 360 micellar water now girl i don't even know if they still make this i got this from cvs a long time ago and yeah i still got it very little left but i still have it hello happy easter happy easter Happy yeah, Easter. Been, How's it been going? Uh, we have to do 32 Easter baskets. Oh, my Lord. Don't talk about yourself like that. Not a whale. Just a shark. So, anywho. Baby's calling. It's Easter. Okay. Now, dead giveaway. But, anywho. We are going to tackle this uh, I think I was talking about this last one which is from the face shop and it's also like a micellar water as well but I'll link all of these again if they're still available any of these will do but since I do have the false one I'm going to use it ups I'm gonna shake it up again so it looks like that and I shook it up and we're gonna take off these lashes like real simple like today that's what we're starting with okay so I just use um, you can use a paper towel, but I just use a cotton round or two, usually two. And since this big one is just looking at me so hard, and I'm going to apply me some more lashes today, actually. Well, this is like, um, kind of have to shake it a little bit, like so. And just hold it on there. And it just dissolves it, man. It just takes it clean off. Amazing stuff. Look at there. One of them is already off. But I'm going to add a little bit more. Didn't quite soak it enough there, in my opinion. So, just like so. And they come falling right off. Look at there. Even though you can pull and tug on them, this stuff is like a miracle worker. <laughs> like, what the world? What is in it? micellar water they should call it miracle water because i tell you it does the job fantastically and i just use some oil to get the residue off if there's any glue still left on there okay and like i said it's like magic magic and that's it one more little piece to go i should hold it on there longer but oh, sometimes i'd be in such a hellfire hurry there we go ah, it's stuck on my face like what and i have a trash can right there i'm just gonna do one more wipe off of my eyelids this one is one of the best oops one of the best ones because it is kind of oily like it does have a little oil in there so it kind of helps to dissolve the glue as well which i like that but when you do your lashes make sure you clean your lash again because this oily residue on here can definitely make them not stick as well as they should so make sure you do use a little water and i say soap but cleanser you still glue on there 
it's still glue baby and that's it y'all so I will probably do my lashes I'm not doing that on camera today but that is it I'm gonna get cute today or something I'm not really sure I hope y'all are having a pleasant awesome amazing day I'm going to use some jojoba oil to try to dissolve some of that glue and I keep these things right here on my vanity and let it roll on off here like so but that's it for right now guys I am out of here and I will catch y'all in a minute to let you know what else is up today and going to be doing today which isn't a whole lot I don't have a little ones around the house anymore I have some leftover sushi that I'm going to eat later um, get up and drink me some apple juice and that'll be that on that I might need coconut oil coconut oil always does the right thing for my glue on my lashes what else is good um I had a couple of oils that I loved but that's all I can remember right now but I'm gonna do that and I will catch y'all in a minute
picture, I could see if I just close my eyes Have the foresight to believe Time don't move backwards, it speeds To the future, feel this lead Charging forward when I open my mouth Though I may not know how I'm good, I'm good Actually, morning good, uh-huh. kinda great uh-huh. Even on the bad days, I thank God for making me When I'm 123 Really wish that all my heroes would notice me So I could be One of the greats on a big stage Inspiring people to pray And give thanks Cause somehow we made it We're always protected I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. Actually, more than good. Uh-huh. Kinda great. Uh-huh. But even on the bad days, I thank God for making me.
listen on We just building It's my season, lay foundation Make a name for Generations, please and make a and take a break or a little vacation and chasing blues away. Hey, hey. You always posting a pictures, trying to look like you winning or look like you always be working, soaking the moments you live in. Yeah, you got the nerve to be on me, faking your life for the IG. If you got my number, don't ask me, cause baby. Beautiful babes, please don't be mad at me. I know you don't know how long it's been since I originally popped in, but girl, it's been hours and hours. I have been going through my skincare products and come to find out I was running low on my new vitamin C. And I love this one, I really do. I'm not sure if I'm going to order any more right now. And in fact, it's, it's out on Avon anyway right now but honey I put some water in here I did because I'm, I'm going to drain this to the hill okay I'm going to drain it out uh, but I do have a couple more that I told y'all I love the banished one but y'all I don't think this is a full size they sent me I really don't think so but I'm going to use this one next and I also have the meticulous antioxidant defense serum which i'm going to use this up i might start with this one next i might try this one out next because i have had it for a while i might try this one out next but you know if you're not using vitamin c in your skincare routine i don't know what you're doing i don't know what you're doing but you do need to get into the vitamin c's because i am here to tell you right now if you want it if you want it right Girl, yeah, vitamin C need to be part of it. And this is my take on it. You know, I'm not a skincare professional, but I've been using vitamin C long enough to tell you that, honey. Get ready for a glow like never before. Honestly, honestly, I'm, I mean, the proof is in the pudding. When you start mixing it up, you're going to see. Let me tell you, here's the lowdown on why you should be slathering on that vitamin C goodness. I want to tell you also how often you should do it and when to incorporate it into your skincare routine. First off, let's talk benefits, honey. Vitamin C. Vitamin C is a superhero for your skin, fighting off those pesky free radicals that can age you faster than you can say wrinkle free i'm telling you it's like a shield against environmental damage helping you to brighten your complexion fade dark spots and even out your skin tone and let's not forget its collagen boosting powers keeping your skin firm and youthful can i get a heck yeah for that radiant glow now, how often should you be lathering on that vitamin C goodness? Well, beautiful babes, consistency is key. I recommend using it every single day, preferably in the morning. Think of it as your daily dose of sunshine for your skin. 
Just a pea-sized amount is all you need to kickstart your day with a burst of antioxidant protection and skin-loving goodness. As for when to incorporate it into your skincare routine, let's just keep it simple, shall we? After cleansing and toning, but before moisturizing and applying sunscreen. That's where vitamin C shines brightest. It's like the VIP guest at your skincare party, prepping your skin to face the day ahead with confidence and radiance. So there you have it, beautiful babes. Vitamin C is your skincare weapon, that secret weapon for achieving that lit from within glow. And again, use it daily, love it fiercely, and watch your skin transform into that radiant masterpiece it was always meant to be. The links for these will be in the description box below if you want to check out any of these, all of these, they're all great to me. Let me know which vitamin C serum you use. Drop it in the comments. Let us all know and why you love it. And if you are a maker of vitamin C, hi, check out my address below, baby. Send me some of yours. I love vitamin C. Now go forth and conquer my beautiful babe skincare warrior. <laughs> Love this. I do. So I'm going to finish up this one and we're going to switch over. We're going to switch over to this meticulous once I finish this off, which I'm going to go ahead and put this on my face and body shoulders tomorrow. And that'll be it. And we'll start off the day fresh or the next day fresh with the meticulous one. So that's that on that. But I'm just going to wind up today because uh, I ain't got nothing else to talk about. I really don't. But I did mention, yeah. I did mention to y'all my refrigerator busted and I do have a new one but hey let me tell you I got some packages so let's talk about what I got from Amazon yeah delivered today a few little things in these packages y'all all right y'all know I've been trying to get all my content and I need space so I did get me another um, SD card for my cameras, I have one big one in there, which is the 128 gigabytes. So this one here will go into my little camera here, my little vlog camera. So we've got that covered. Hold on. Told y'all I'm working it out and I'm working it out. Oh girl, this was so cute. I wish it was bigger though. I you know I've been working out and you know sometimes you just need that motivation and you have to sometimes motivate yourself did I say sometimes I mean every day you should motivate yourself you should look in the mirror and say something amazing and powerful to yourself every freaking day they don't want me to get in this, obviously, to show y'all. All right, I think we finally got something going on here. And y'all, the funny part, I posted this little quote on my Facebook page the other day. It states, if it doesn't challenge you, it won't change you. And this is going into my transformation station workout room. Yeah, because I need to look at that every freaking day that I go in there and I start my workout routine. Gotta have it. Gotta have it. Then, again, it's about the content. I don't want to clutter up my computer. So I did buy me a 2 terabyte portable external storage so I've been needing this for a minute and before it gets too cluttered off in there I'm gonna dump some stuff out and keep it pushing okay um well they got it tightened up so good but I did get a green one so this is gonna go on my big computer I don't really use uh the external drive on my little laptops because I just kind of move around with them or just responding to emails and so forth and so on like that 
and then they gave me this big box for this little item right here which is some ordinary lactic acid yeah i gotta have this y'all this is one of my skin saviors it is this is the lactic acid 10 percent with hyaluronic acid okay i don't know if y'all can see that or not but that's that and finally what y'all were waiting on is my little mini fridge she's so little she's so cute i fell in love with this one it just it did not go with my bathroom so i decided i'm going to put it in my bedroom like i mentioned earlier and let that go so we are going to go ahead and set this up together and put my skincare in there it has like gold or rose gold looking hardware on it i thought it was so so cute y'all look at there isn't she adorable it looks smaller than my other one actually you know i know i've had the other one for a while so they may have done some revamping on the little mini fridges let's see how to open it do she just does she just open oh she just pulls open oh of course the cord the manual and what's different about this one in the little door there's a little little chef isn't that cute oh same thing cool warm etc we're gonna go set her up if y'all want to come along with me i guess i have to take y'all on my vlog camera because i'm not moving the big camera no she ain't she not she not gonna she not gonna do that so come along with me we'll set it up and we do it like that okay Hey, beautiful babes thank you so much for coming to hang out with me i appreciate all of my beautiful babes always coming through y'all are the real vips and i appreciate you i hope you enjoyed today's video i hope you found it fun helpful 
etc etc if you did make sure you let me know by dropping some purple hearts down in the comments y'all I do appreciate y'all so very much and I am so glad you're here I'm so glad you found me if you lost me before you got me back again so stick and stay make sure you subscribe to the channel so you won't lose this chick turn on your notification bell so you'll be one of the first to know when I upload and please tell a friend where you're hanging out at Tell them why you're looking so cute. <laughs> Let them know you've been hanging out with your girl, Sweet Angel. So please share me with your world. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye now. Yeah.